A piece of town history is demolished Thursday in Uxbridge. The town's almost 100 year old station is knocked down. And while it's a bittersweet moment for many, a new station was desperately needed. Our Chandler Walsh joins us live now with more. Chandler. Olivia, the, depart the department was live streaming the demolition today. It got thousands of views as the town watched a 90 year old building come apart. A piece of town history reduced to rubble. The old Uxbridge fire station gets demolished. Dan Hicks and Roy Henry are retired Uxbridge firefighters. They watched as their old headquarters came down. It's just been part of the town for so long, uh, part of my life for so long. So it's sad to see uh, this old home uh, that I spent a lot of my days working out of. Uh, to be coming down, but sometimes we have to lose a piece of history. The old station was built in 1928. Fire Chief Bill Kessler says it no longer fit the department's equipment. Every piece of equipment we bought had to be essentially downsized, so it kind of li limited our creativity to get apparatus to meet today's needs. The department moved into their new station a few weeks ago. Chief Kessler says it's almost four times larger and now fits their ladder truck gives us a, a whole lot more room to, uh, to operate in, um, so it just allows us to be more efficient with our responses. The old station was demolished Thursday to make room for town parking spaces. Hicks says the department wanted a new station, but it's a bittersweet sight. It has a tremendous amount of memories, uh, a lot of good things, a lot of funny things, a lot of sad things. It's kind of sad to see it go. Uxbridge has a fire museum just down the street from the old station, so though, though the building is gone, pieces of it are still left. Olivia? All right, sounds good. Thank you, Chandler.